busy section of Flushing, Queens gets a major makeover, but with it comes construction pains, and that means big problems for both pedestrians and drivers. CBS 2's Vanessa Murdoch reports. Saturday, forget about it. Really? Yeah, not, don't even come in Flushing. Heavy equipment at work at the future site of Flushing Commons at the intersection of Union Street and 39th Avenue. But some say this setup is an accident waiting to happen. Did you feel safe as you walked? No, because I feel like, you know, someone would come by and like hit me or something. Along Union Street, the sidewalk is cut off. And instead of adhering to signs, people walk here anyway in the traffic lanes. It's dangerous. But you still walk along this street? Because I see so, so many people walking this way that I'm like, going to follow the flow, I guess. Right. So do you think that there should be a sidewalk here? There should be. No sidewalk, that's just one issue. The traffic's another. This is a mass transportation hub with thousands of people and hundreds of cars at any given time. Because of construction, three lanes are now down to two. We don't like it, but it's the way it is. Yeah, so what can we do? Kelvin Tin says sitting in his car is commonplace now that Flushing Commons is going up. For future, when you talk about future, maybe it's worth it, but for now, I don't think so. Senator Tony Avella says right now there are more questions than answers about how this nightmare came to life. Why was permission given, if it was, to the contract to close off that one lane of traffic, which is also a bus route? Two, why was the contractor allowed to close off the sidewalk? We asked the DOT these questions, and after repeated calls, they just got back to us moments ago, saying they're exploring the addition of a left turn signal and other traffic controls nearby. From Flushing, Queens, Vanessa Murdoch, CBS 2 News. Local business owners say that the construction is creating problems for them as well, hurting their bottom line. The